Hi Aquarius, welcome to my channel. This is a special reading session for you guys. I hope you're doing well. This is for Aquarius friends. This is a special session for Aquarius. This is an after breakup tarot reading session for Aquarius friends. Applicable for singles only for Aquarius. Alright. Um, the reading for today, it has no timeline. It has no time frame. And um, it is for Aquarius sign. Please universe, what can I get for Aquarius? What's the message ready for Aquarius to know and meant for them to know for the after breakup tarot reading messages inside for Aquarius, please. Okay. The chariot card, the tower card, the page of cups, the death card. All right, you are in your element, Aquarius. Um, all right, let's start the reading, Aquarius. You've got here the chariot card in upright position, the tower card in reverse, the page of cups in upright position, and the death card. So what I'm getting from here, Aquarius, is that um, someone tried to save the relationship. Um, the signs that's involved, possibly involved, um, this could be a Cancer, um, a Pisces, a Scorpio, so Cancer and Scorpio, or a Pisces, and then I'm really getting a Libra in here. I don't know why I felt in the Tower card in reverse. It looks like it feels like a Libra, a, a Libra energy. Anyhow, so the past energy it seems to be a situation where your person have to leave you. All right, um, they choose the dark side. Uh, the Cancer card. This is around June or July or August month. Um, the, ch the, the cancer card it talks about victory and it's also taking chances and choosing the road to success or the, the next road to take path so with a combination of the two cards your person your situation in the past they took the um, the road to leave you you know so this is this is your person your your situation in the past so they they possibly travel overseas they took they took the wrong road the road to where you aren't included so if you look at the tower card color and this um this other beast so i felt like this is you in the right in the um where uh, this is the, the left this is the right so your person took the left side of you know they, they took a different route in short all right um so your person your situation had a change of heart change of mind a change of direction and the decision making that they did was for their own benefit like you are not included in the plan so it went ahead because the chariot is a progressive card it's a traveling card it is moving forward card however the journey that your person or your situation took took in the past um you aren't included in the plan they took the road and it has made you for some of you shock um although the tower card is in upright in a reverse position that it took for some of you um it took you um what is that word it made you um it it frees you all right the decision making that your person um choose over the relationship like um it, it made you feel stunned like you you were immobilized that your person left you or they took the other route or they took a different direction or they did not include you in the travel or in the plan um, you try to save this person i mean sorry you try to save the relationship someone tried to save the relationship someone tried to convince the other person to stay and to delay the travel or to delay the plan because for some of your queries you know for a fact that if this person leaves you or if they move um temporarily for an opportunity uh, a job abroad or something to do where relocation is required this is your fear and you try to convince them not to do it in a general um energy you you or someone tried to convince the person to to don't leave the the relationship or do not you know do not um accept that change because i felt like for some of you there was a strong calling for your person to action 
you know, um, you were really moving forward along. You know, this is your energy. This is their energy. So you were moving. You were moving together, but your person have to take this route uh, because of a call to change. Um, you know, location related to career, or for some of you, it's related to family that they need to go overseas or they need to move to a place where it's closer to their children, or because of responsibility. But you were really going well that you know the journey of you together was going well but they have to change Ruth and they did not take you or you were not included in the plan or they did not consider you or the relationship so you tried to convince them you know I'm really picking up um, a, someone tried to convince the person to stay um, to have an alternative solution to save the relationship you know because page of cups this is an emotional um, yeah, this is an emotional message this is an emotional support this is i felt like it's it's you know it is being you know the page of cups it's facing the cancer card in the tower card so this is for some of you literally you prevent them to accept the offer or to leave you behind that you really use your charm your wit you know the emotional feelings that you've got to each other you use that feeling to use your love you use whatever you can use to change their mind but it seems to be it has proceed and um the ending is that the death card in upright position you might be dealing with a scorpio but for some of you i'm really picking up the word it is it's been a year it's been six months it's been six years something to do with reaching a milestone or an anniversary okay so for some of you your person has to leave you because of um of a sickness or a death and they have to be there and they have to stay a little bit there behind and you know it it, it um it fuck up the relationship you know it made you and this person stagnant all right because because of long distance you felt freeze because you always have to wait for them to synchronize with you in terms of timing in terms of schedule something to do with that there's a lot of factors but one of the factors is travel or it is possibly a decision making where they made because for some of you i'm picking up aquarius your person decided made the made a decision without actually consulting you like you were just informed um you were you're the last person informed or when they inform you they've already made a decision that you you can't change because if you look at the you know the, the, the cancer card the chariot card it has already made the path going to whatever they're going through and even if you convince them because this is the sad part you tried to convince someone tried to convince to change their mind but um it's too late they they have already checked out thank you spirit so someone already checked out before someone convinced the other person it was too late to convince it was too late to convince or to change to change their mind they have already checked out checked out for some of you this has been planned for a long time you knew for for some of you that it would happen you you keep delaying it the tower also speaks about delay so there's there's different different kind of energy i'm picking up w with you guys but in a nutshell it it has proceeded and you're not part of the plan um the death card as a result of that the, ter the death card energy came along so you might be dealing with a scorpio but this is something inevitable is something that um something that you cannot prevent from happening you know you can't really make them stay if they don't want to so you've decided to release each other you know at the end you tried but you couldn't win them back you couldn't convince them you couldn't change their mind so you have to let go you have to release if you haven't then the death card is telling you it is time to release and start a new cycle because this is past they have moved already move out they've already checked out so for some of you aquarius you might the res residual energy bitterness and pain is still around you so the card is telling you, you've tried your best sweetheart it is time to move on it is time to release whatever it is that's blocking you because the tower card is also in reverse so speak, it speaks about delay or blockages so you know make sure that you're you have moved on you've started to move on or you know you, you have accepted something to do with accepting and you know ac embracing a new cycle if, if you don't embrace or welcome the new cycle then you would always be stuck with you know with the tower card in reverse okay now moving to a more futuristic um 
futuristic outcome between you and this person. You might be dealing with Cancer, Scorpio, Pisces. You've got Libra energy. You've got Capricorn, Taurus, or a Virgo. A Gemini, Libra, Aquarius as well. And then, so moving on to more futuristic um, vibe inside and energy. You've got three of pentacles. So, um, and then six of swords. I felt like with the combination of these two, this is around December time. I'm really picking up a strong December time to January time where this is your energy Aquarius, Gemini, Libra, Aquarius. This is definitely your energy. Because um, the last card is the death card. So it could be you've decided to release like, you know, the accepting part that you break up or the accepting because the star card here is in reverse so it means that you've moved on and you lost hope the star card in reverse speaks about you know there's you've accepted that there's no hope or there's less chances so you've decided to move on because for some of you you're not getting input you're not getting a reply because i've got here the page of cups so someone really tried but you're not getting a response a reply you're not getting that you know collaborative effort or interest from your person or from a situation after the breakup so someone declared i need to move on because i look stupid i feel stupid for waiting something that it is not gonna matter it is not gonna happen or it is something that you're feeling like it's hopeless you know um three of pentacles in here i'm really really picking up a very strong message that it's not over yet you know things will pick up again um, but you've got to release it first it, there's a call there's a message for you here aquarius to move on with a light energy like um you know move on without although it's it's difficult to advise but once you release and accept that the situation it's something that it didn't work um because i felt like your person felt the like some sort of a choke you know you, they feel choked about the relationship and even though you guys break up they, there's they, there's still a, a blockage um like the, the 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 energy between the two of you it, it is blocked your person thinks of you as one of their blockages or choke they feel like they couldn't breathe along the relationship and so once you release like this is a typical of if you stop calling them texting them or making a move to remind them that i'm still here because for some of you um you don't want this person to totally forget you so you call them you message them you text them although for some of you it is polite but it, it they felt bombarded because this person is moving on they've checked out already and the fact that you're following up it it annoyed them for some of you that you know leave me alone that's what i'm getting you know it's 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 leave me alone so as soon as you stop calling or following up or messaging or you totally release them like the death card and accept that maybe it's time for me to move on maybe it's time for me to really change direction like my ex or like the situation it has changed direction it's time to put my focus to myself this is where your your person will feel the release and it would be some sort of um because the three of pentacles is in here so there's an effort but the effort it wouldn't activate it if you don't accept the breakup you know it's something to do with how can we get back together if you don't accept the breakup in the first place so you know it's it's a question for you aquarius yep you separated you break up but did you really accept the reason why you break up did you forgive him forgive her or you did you forgive yourself something to do with you need to to give a closure in order for in order for the three of pentacles to take place the universe is telling you aquarius that you need to close it off you need to give yourself a peace a closure release it so that you you start with a new cycle and i felt like there's a new cycle for you whether it's a new person or the same person i felt like your 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 person you know there's still a bit of an announced um visit or an announced calling from your person only if you stop all right some sort of when you stop calling them following up or you when you release release them sort of acceptance or closure or you made peace with yourself or your situation that i'm i'm saying bye bye i'm gonna give myself a break my thoughts my feelings with my ex you know bye bye this is where the three of pentacles gonna be activated the judgment card it is in reverse it means that maybe you're think you, you keep saying we break up we i'm moving on but you haven't really reworked that through so that's the thing that you really need to give yourself a complete 
healing complete check out you check out too you release because when once you release the energy that's where you know new people situation will come into your life imagine it, it's you're still blocked all right you're still surrounded by your ex energy by this thing that you cannot move on for some of you so you need to work on your chakra and release you know give it to the universe okay whatever it is that because there's a hangover there's still a hangover in here although for some of you are trying but part of you need to release it okay um yep there's still you know a hope i'd say but only if you release everything out like if you clear out and accept like breathe and inhale and exhale and accept that i've been you know i've been this you know I've, I've my ex break up with me he is no longer in my life he said goodbye i need to move on i'm releasing it okay so that is where the universe the universe will not give you something or will the universe will not give you uh, some sort of reconnection if you aren't ready like you have some home homework to do thank you spirit you have some homework to do there is still a chance futuristically especially especially around december and january month you guys have a chance that un unannounced you know like your surprise of a calling i'm really seeing you having shock seeing your ex um calling you their name appearing again in your um um again a call you know you've probably deleted their number and then you would be surprised that you will receive a call and you've realized that that call was your ex so i'm really seeing that it would still happen but before this person um made move to you you need to clear your aura first like accept the breakup accept that this is what happened start a new cycle within yourself so that this you know reconnection could take place because i see the judgment card in here it's reflective of that something unannounced unfinished is yet to be some sort of a contract that they need to finalize with you all right like a contractual soul like this this person whoever this is they meant to give you a closure a second follow-up like a follow-up with you around december january time okay so thank you aquarius for tuning in today i hope you like the reading i hope you resonate and take care. I'll see you soon again. Bye-bye.